Okay, so I'm using Blender to add my videos, and Blender isn't the most user-friendly piece of software to edit videos in, but it can be done. You just have to be a little patient and learn it, just like any other program. But there's this thing about frame rates, when you put in different videos with different frame rates, because your capture software is not capturing in 60 frames per second like it should so your, all your videos are coming in at 59 and sometimes 60 frames per second which really you should fix that yeah I know I should fix it okay so you import your strip it looks like this your sound and audio aren't aligned and you could just go change the frame right here but I don't want to do that because I want it all to be in 60 frames per second and right now it's 59 so I could go here effect strip speed control using my page up page down key to snap to the end of the sound go to the handle on the video strip press shift s and it snaps it to the end of the audio the speed control strip it will already be set to stretch to input strip length and then that means this will equal this and you want to cut it here so you cut move that out of the way But now you see the speed isn't correct because the speed is going off of this new strip. So it's not cutting it like a whole piece of pie. It's like taking out the filling and just feeding you the filling. You don't want the filling. You just want the whole thing to work. You just want it to work. <laughs> so the way to fix this is to make a meta strip group. That way when you're trying to fix your frame rate with a speed control, you can cut that strip, you can edit that strip, you can cut it, move it, tweak it, do whatever, and it won't mess with the speed of the initial strip. So how you do that is you select all the strips that you want to group, and you just do Control G, and that groups them. If you want to look inside the group to adjust your audio or whatever, you tap, and it brings up the group. And you can go in and adjust it, and tap again to go back to the main and then if you want to take it out of the group that's alt G and so once it's in a meta strip you can cut wherever and see we cut there and we want this and see how it's not it's not going super fast it's just the same it's what you want to happen you want that strip to apply to the video strip without speeding up or shortening or whatever so that's how you get around different frame rates in blender using meta strips in order to edit those speed control strips without them affecting your video strip i hope this helps you